Without our coverage of the coronavirus pandemic, 35 states, including the FCT, have taken delivery of the COVID-19 Oxford AstraZeneca vaccine. This is according to the executive director of the National Primary Healthcare Development Agency. He was invited to give the National Economic Council update on the national rollout of the COVID-19 vaccine. Dr. Faisal Shuaib disclosed at the monthly NEC virtual meeting presided by Vice President Yemiyo Shimbaju that only Kogi State is yet to get a batch of the AstraZeneca vaccine. He also said that there is need for tight security around the vaccines in the states to avoid being vandalized by hoodlums. Council was also briefed on the ease of doing business, subnational environmental survey, and the national monitoring and evaluation policy. According to the NPDHC, all states, all states of the Federation have received their vaccines, except uh, uh, Kogi State. Uh, and then uh, we have reports that the vaccination application has been launched in most of the states. And also there's a plan uh, to have the ICPC uh, co-opted into uh, the vaccine accountability to ensure that things are done properly and transparently. Also, the issue of the controversy over AstraZeneca's uh, vaccine uh, also came up, and uh, the council was informed that according to WHO, uh, countries uh, uh, should and could continue with the vaccine administration uh, while awaiting uh, further scientific and empirical uh, testing. The expected uh, benefits of this uh, exercise for MLE policy will also include reducing waste and leakages of the public funds, improving the quality of public spending, providing the independent objectives, assessment of the merit public fund strategies, uh, as well as programs. We know that the state governments are expected to domesticate the national MLE policy for effective performance striking, uh, as well as uh, continuous monitoring. Uh, SMEs also talked about road infrastructure, they talked about power, they talked about regulatory challenges, uh, paying of taxes, multiplicity of charges. So we'll be working with state uh, uh, internal revenue agencies to make sure that there's harmony. Uh, the, the thing that is interesting is that the comparisons are there. So the states that have taken the time already to start reducing some of these things, you have the businesses commenting about that, and the states that are not yet aware, this is also a peer review document that would enable state governments to see how they are doing in comparison and how...